Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we will be discussing about suburban uh, railway corridor that is uh, corridor to Malige corridor from uh, Chikbanawara to Beniganadi. Basically, this corridor 2 can be split into three parts. One is Chikbanawara to Eshwantapura and Eshwantapura to Lotagolali and sorry. Uh, between Eshwantapura and Hebbala and from Hebbala till Benikanadi. So why this split? Because between Chikabanawara and Eshwantapura, it's almost land is completely railways and they don't have any hurdles here and it's going smooth. I mean, uh, almost uh, not till completely till Eshwantapura, almost till Eshwantapura. Here and there a little bit uh, uh, land acquisition issues are there. But apart from that, between Eshwantapura and Ebbala, it is elevated corridor and uh, moreover from Eshwantapura till uh, uh, Lotagolali, it, it will be uh, rail over road. So here uh, the land acquisition and rehabilitation, it's uh, actually uh, we posted on our Twitter account that recently land acquisition is clear in the sense uh, most of the people got the land uh, compensation. So now the thing is now comes rehabilitation so now once the uh, uh, amount is settled they need to rehabilitate the people who are staying there for a long time so uh, there is a uphill task because it's almost uh, looks like a, a little bit area is a slum so i feel uh, they face a lot of issues here so between Eshwantpura and Lotagolati it may take a lot of time whereas from uh, Lotagolati to Ebala it's already work is uh, uh, work has kicked in and uh, it's going uh, going on. So uh, we have uh, posted pictures of that as well recently on our Twitter account. And between Ebbala and uh, Beniganali, here it's a different task for uh, LNT. Why? Because here the suburban project as well as uh, the uh, doubling railway doubling. So both are clubbed in and they are uh, making a lot of changes over here so basically whatever the suburban thought that earlier was uh, whatever the uh, gradient or uh, profile of that geography uh, uh, geography profile over there so they used to lay their suburban track and uh, wherever level crossings and all um, underpass comes right so there they uh, thought of uh, uh, constructing a flyover or railway and bridge and all those things now that complete plan got changed because they had doubling project as well so and there are a lot of land acquisition because it's very narrow area so land acquisition and uh, rehabilitation also comes into uh, picture here so what uh, lnt uh, come up with a, a plan was to uh, increase the gradient of existing tracks itself so that uh, there is no chance of flyover and all those things so that railways will go uh, one gradient above and all the existing uh, the uh, traffic of local traffic will uh, flow through uh, flow as a railway under bridge okay this was the plan between Ebala and Beniganali so between Ebala and Beniganali how many uh, uh, how many stations we have one is Ebala and uh, Kanakanagara and uh, Nagavara and uh, Banaswadi and Seva Nagara and Kasuri Nagara and Banaswadi. So these many stations are planned between uh, these two uh, location. And moreover, uh, now let's dive into how the progress is between uh, Ebala and Beniganali railway station. Uh, we all know, I mean, we have already explained that between Ebala and Beniganali, both doubling as well as suburban railway project is clubbed as single project here. Uh, thing is, uh, I will explain how it happens. So now, uh, the Indian Railways one track is up and running, so operations are on. But now what happens, uh, for suburban, they are constructing a retaining wall here. So the purpose of retaining wall is to increase the gradient of existing tracks itself to two floors uh, in our uh, um, uh, house uh, in terms of house right so two floor building 
so to, till that level they are going to increase the gradient of the existing uh, tracks itself so for that retaining wall construction is happening over here so once the retaining uh, wall construction is done then they will go, uh, uh, gonna dump a um, uh, complete mud and uh, 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 the level will happen so once that is done they will add one track on that part to the uh, if you are coming from Benical and side, right side part of the existing track they will add one uh, Indian Railway track okay so there are uh, temporary uh, diversions that are planned from the existing railway tracks so what they will do they will link the existing railway track to the um, the newly see here it's planned i guess so to newly uh, constructed uh, uh, indian railway um, i mean uh, suburban track so once uh, that diversion happens what they will do they will dismantle the existing railway track structures okay once the diversion is done they will uh, dismantle the existing railway uh, track structure and what they will do they will construct uh, the other end of the retaining wall structure and they will completely add uh, so before that the temporary retaining wall will happen here somewhere middle uh, in middle of existing railway track and the new uh, retaining wall uh, the temporary retaining wall will be there and one more retaining wall will come on the other end so for four tracks altogether so once the uh, second retaining wall construction is done they will level complete end to end retaining wall from left to right and they will add all other uh, three tracks okay and the uh, the right of the two tracks will be handed over to uh, k ride that is uh, for suburban operations and the other two will be handed over to indian railways as a double track so this is how the plan is between ebbala and beniganali that's where the construction of corridor 2 will delay behind our imagination probably three years or four years we cannot uh, estimate it because there are a lot of issues over here the one is um, military uh, area um, near Kasturi Nagara and uh, uh, this whatever uh, doubling track so first uh, we they need to construct the new track and they need to divert the existing uh, Indian railways operations I don't know uh, we have seen in uh, the existing uh, uh, quadrupling itself how much efforts it takes from railway sites they are, their bureaucratic level is on different level so uh, that is because the existing operations will uh, have a very bad it so uh, the freight our existing uh, express and all those things right so how they plan for it will also matter so I feel uh, this between Ebal and Beniganali, it's behind uh, uh, 2028 or 2030 itself. So this is the Ebala station location that is for suburban. So this is the suburban railway station, Ebala railway station. And this way the Ebola metro station will come and both will be interlinked with FOB and also the BMTC depot will come up here. And we have a inter, uh, Indian Railways station over here. So a uh, platform will be extended almost till here and uh, they are coming up with FOB on this side as well because we will have a Indian Railways track here. So people cannot uh, simply jump to this side so that's why they are planning up with FOB from year to year and as well as from year to year so that people can uh, cross over the track Indian Railways track and even they can walk into the existing Indian Railways station as well so this is where Ebala station is planned and next is Kanakanagara After Hebala station, it's Kanakanagara station, so which is which connects to uh, the Virana Palya or uh, Manyata Tech Park. So, this whatever the Hati Nagar comes right. So, this is where the second station will come up. Uh, 
uh, for this station i mean uh, basically this was this is this as a level crossing so this level crossing will be converted to uh, the railway hunter bridge and moreover uh, here the station in, is planned in such a way that they have uh, they are adding a um, similar type of uh, culverts here so uh, the culverts uh, uh, usage is so that vehicles come come i mean they can use uh, the this rub for uh, regular traffic and moreover they have coming up with two rub uh, uh, structure like that not in the same width reduced width just for four wheelers and two wheelers so this this will be under bridge for uh, below the station station itself so uh, the mmi that is uh, multimodal uh, interchange like uh, something like that so bmtc or uh, for uh, vehicle parking and all those things they are planning it here so they uh, people can use these rubs for such purpose uh, this how the, the uh, station is planned. Uh, so a little gradient will come here. The gradient is e e uh, here it's increased. We, we can show you that in the uh, video where the construction is underway. So we we are uh, uh, adding the that video as well, the construction video. So this is Kanaka Nagara station and after that it's Nagwara. So Nagwara station is will come up at Nagwara Road. Here as well, um, the RUB will come up uh, below the station. One is here and one is here. This is any of water culverts. So apart from water culvert, there are two more culverts that will be added as uh, road structure uh, so that people, uh, two wheeler and four wheelers can uh, go under the station itself and uh, uh, this side as well and uh, the both uh, sides of the station it will be road so that people can access uh, the station from both ends this is how Nagwara station is planned and next is Banaswadi in at Banaswadi station there is no work that has been started yet uh, one is uh, one reason uh, could be the, the lot of uh, a doubling work that is going on so um, probably uh, once that is done so this is some uh, the proposed future station so Kaveri Nagara so it's uh, uh, marked as future as on day this is not the one once this road is done here yeah. this way the bonus for station comes here the work has not yet started but basically um, here some additional uh, land is required for the station so that's where um, uh, the some of the demolition of, uh, of uh, buildings are happening so once that is done maybe probably uh, work will start over here And this is where the Seva Nagar station will come up. Seva Nagar and SMVT will be interconnected with uh, uh, FOB. <coughs> and after that, this is a <coughs> grade level station. Uh, <coughs> and after this, Kasturi Nagara. And then comes Beniganadi. Benigali station uh, corridor 2 and as well as corridor 4 uh, will come up on the same uh, elevated structure so actually uh, we have a video where it shows almost um, uh, 10 to 12 uh, um, pillars are already erected here so work is going on uh, well here so uh, these were both corridor 2 as well as corridor 4 will <clears throat> in a uh, way interchange over here. 